This video is sponsored by um, Guitar Super System, my, my learning platform. I'm going to be playing some copyrighted music, so if you'd like to support this channel, I can't monetize this video. Check out Guitar Super System. This video is also sponsored by a TikTok that I will eventually harvest from this video and post. You can find a link in the description if you'd like to follow me or Bethany over there because Bethany is really the reason this whole video is happening. She noticed something in the trends of TikTok. Olivia Rodrigo came out with a new song called Good For You. I listened to it because it's everywhere. And then, weirdly, I was singing Misery Business by Paramore. Wait a second, why am I singing this song? I haven't heard it at all today, but the one song I had heard a lot was Good For You by Olivia Rodrigo. So then I was like, oh my gosh, they're very similar. I wanna know from a musician's point of view, what are the similarities, what are the differences? Did Olivia copy Paramore? Olivia is a copycat or is she just inspired <laughs> by Paramore? Did she copy them, Howard? Did she? Answer me! Well, let's find out. The Olivia Rodrigo song was 83 or 84 BPM and the Paramore song was 86 BPM. So I really just had to adjust the Paramore song a little bit. Also with the Olivia Rodrigo song, I had to pitch shift it down. First thing I'll show you is how well these two songs blend together. I'm just gonna go four bars of one song's chorus, four bars of the other song's chorus. It honestly is a little haunting. It sounds like one person is singing across these two songs. Check it out. So here's the harmony for the Olivia Rodrigo song. The Paramore one goes. So if you want to look at it from the key of A flat major, this is the four chord. Then we go to the root chord. Then we go to the five chord. And then the six minor, back to the five back to the four. The only discrepancy between the two chorus chord progressions, this happens straight ahead on the Paramore side. And this is an anticipation on the Olivia Rodrigo side. But overall the same thing. Now let's check out the melody. This little line in the Olivia song. And then this one in the Paramore song. It's funny, I played it differently for each song, but it's actually the same notes. Now the ultimate test, which one is more fun to solo over? I guess playing the melodies alone back to back might reveal 
they're not so similar. So my conclusion is, while I don't think this song is a direct ripoff, I think that certain harmony lends itself to certain sorts of melodic choices, and I guess eventually everybody rubs up against one another. <laughs>